Good morning, welcome back to another weekly vlog. It is Bank Holiday Monday today, so it's a fairly quiet one. Um, I am just going over to see my friend Katrina and meet her new baby, Rian. Um, she usually lives in Ireland now, but she's back for Easter um, and staying at her parents, and they live just down the road from me. So it'll be nice to see her and to meet baby Rian. Um, yeah. So that's where I'm going and then this afternoon I don't really have any plans so I need to kind of get on with some video editing and stuff like that but yeah, I'm gonna go and see my friend for now. So I've just got back from seeing my friend Katrina and her new baby Rian. I say new baby, he's eight weeks but I still say that's new. Um, he is so cute. Um, I said to Katrina, I was like, if I bring him home would you notice? <laughs> Um, but yeah, he's really cute, so it was nice to see him and to catch up with Katrina as well. Um, I've just put some lunch on to cook, and I've just been opening some posts that came on Saturday that I hadn't got around to opening yet, so I thought I'd show you um, what I have opened. So first up, I have got my next Mind membership magazine. Um, I always find these really interesting to read through, and it's also nice to know that I'm supporting um, a charity that kind of means a lot to me. Um, so I've got that to read. I have also got my next set of the Disney Wisdom pins. They came really quickly this time. Um, and this time they are a, well, Winnie the Pooh, Christopher Robin quote. So you've got Tigger, Piglet, and then the quote. And the quote is, you're braver than you believe, stronger than you th seem, and smarter than you think. Um, and it's one of my favorite Disney quotes. So yeah, these are definitely one of my favorites so far. Um, and then the last thing is um, a friend of mine on Facebook, no, not Facebook, Instagram. Um, I think she saw that I'd posted that I had read, I was reading After You, and she asked if I had read the third one, and I didn't actually realise that there was a third one, but she said that she had finished it and um, wondered if I'd like her to send it to me. So she sent me the Jojo Moyes Still Me book, which I'm really looking forward to reading. Um, I then got a, oh, just dropped it on the floor. Um, she then sent a postcard in it, which just says taco and a little message on the back. Her name's Claire. So if you're watching this, thank you very much, Claire. And she's also sent some teas and a Maltesers hot chocolate. She said she knows how much I like tea. So we have got um this one which is an organic good night relaxing tea um just says i don't know what brand it is or whether that is the brand um so there's that one there's then this one which is by heath and heather um which is dandelion burdock and hawthorn and i don't think i've ever actually tried dandelion tea so i'll be interested to see what that one's like um and then we've got two pucker teas which i love um, there's this one which is the womankind one and it's like kind of like shiny I love the packaging um, so that's organic cranberry rose and sweet vanilla which sounds amazing and then this one which I absolutely love which is the pucker nighttime tea so yeah thank you so much Claire for sending those things I'm looking forward to reading the book with a nice cup of tea or maybe a cup of hot chocolate I've had a very productive afternoon um, I'm trying to edit together a video um, which might already be up now actually um, but it's called my favorite things about winter I did one about autumn and had a few people kind of asking if I was gonna do like winter and spring and summer um, I quite enjoyed doing them um, but it is a lot of like editing clips together and like if you know any kind of like editing software like putting bits on top of each other because um, you've got like the voiceover and then you've got the um, pictures you've got the text and also music um so it takes quite a long time and also getting all the different clips together as well um a lot of them i already had but i've found like i've edited what i can together and there's a few little bits that i just need to film um some little clips for so i'm hoping i can do that tonight um and then possibly get it finished and uploaded tomorrow we'll see um but yeah it's taken quite a lot of like it's very very fiddly compared to editing like a sit down video or even not it's it's more fiddly than a weekly vlog generally um but i really like the outcome so yeah i'm it's getting on all right but i've kind of got to like quarter past six and i'm 
I'm tired now and I can't really do any more until I filmed my last little bits so I'm kind of giving up for now. Um, I've been feeling a bit funny today, I keep feeling like really shaky. Um, when I went to my friend's house this morning I felt myself being quite shaky um, and I was holding the baby but I was like sitting down and had my arms sort of resting on the sofa so it was okay but um, yeah I don't quite know what's causing that but I just don't feel quite with it <laughs> um, but anyway I'm going to go downstairs now and have my four to sip and have a fairly kind of quiet evening tomorrow is my grandma's 93rd birthday which is pretty amazing um, and we're going to take her to a garden centre for a bit of lunch and a little look around because she just loves that kind of thing um, and we didn't want her being on her own or anything like that for her birthday so it would just be nice for her to spend some time with some of us lot um, well hopefully she'll enjoy it anyway um, so yeah that's kind of the plan for tomorrow I'm hoping I'll have a, a bit of time to do some little like editing bits but I kind of feel like my grandma's birthday comes first because that's important um, so anyway yeah just gonna have a quiet night now and hopefully get some sleep ready for tomorrow good afternoon I haven't really been very well this morning um, I've, I've just had a really bad tummy um, I've been in like I've been, well, I've been in so much pain, um, I've been stuck in the loo basically, sorry it's a bit TMI but um, I've just been really feeling really really ill um, and in a lot of pain, really sick um, and yeah just not not what I need, I'm absolutely shattered already and I'm, not, I'm still in my blooming pyjamas which actually I haven't worn these ones before. Um, but it says drink, tea and read books and they're from Primark but for, well, I got them quite a while ago for a birthday present. Um, so yeah, I've had a very unproductive day which is kind of annoying. Um, so we were going to be taking my grandma out for lunch at a garden centre because it's her 93rd birthday today. Um, but she rang up. Well, she rang last night and she rang this morning and she said she didn't really feel up to going out. Um, which actually now is probably a good thing because I don't think I would have made it. But um, my dad's, my mum and dad have gone to pick her up and they're going to bring her back to ours. Um, have a little bit of lunch. She can sit out in the garden because she loves doing that. Um, and we can do a cake and things like that. So it'll just be a lot more relaxed and chilled out, which I think is probably what I need and obviously what she needs. Um, and you know, we can always do the garden centre another day. Um, but yeah, I am going to attempt to get dressed now in the hope that I kind of start feeling a bit better. Um, I really want to get my video finished that I was editing yesterday. Um, so I can get that up. And yeah, see what else happens today. I haven't really got any plans apart from having my grandma over. So we've just had some lunch with my grandma. Um, I think she's gone to sit in the garden for a bit and I'm just finishing sorting out this video to try and get it uploaded but I just looked over to the corner of the room and there's a massive spider um I can kind of cope with little ones but this is a beast and I don't want to if I'm well it's behind my light and if I move my light I know it's going to move and I just can't I, I can't cope with them when they move I hate them um I don't know how long it's been there either but it's really big I don't like spiders, please. Oh, I need someone to come and catch it. Oh, it just makes me shudder. Like, I wouldn't kill a spider, but I just don't want them in the house. Um, so, yeah, I'm kind of... I've, I'm sitting here with my legs up on my chair. Um, oh, I don't know, it's always a problem with spiders because I kind of feel like if I ignore it and it goes away, I don't know where it's gone. So you've always got that thought in your mind, like, where is that spider? Um, but I can't really catch them either when they're that big because it just freaks me out. Um, and especially this one, like, because it's in a corner, like, if I move the light to get to the spider, I know the spider's going to move and I know it will run, like, behind a chest of drawers or under the bed or something like that. And then I won't be able to get it and I know where it will be. And, yeah, so I don't really know what to do, but... I just don't like spiders. <laughs> I'm not sure how well you can see, but I just literally I looked over and I saw like that black 
thing like right in the corner and I was like oh what's that and I was like is it some wire and then I was like that is not wire that is a beast of a spider you can't really see it properly because it's all kind of like curled up in the corner but oh it's just making me feel a bit funny Rebecca is on the case finding a way to collect this uh, to catch this spider oh jeez <laughs> I actually want to cry, it's not even funny. What are you going to do with it? I'm just going to poke it and see what it does. It, well, might, it might be dead. It does not look dead. If you poke it and it moves, then what? <laughs> no, no, because it, oh, it will come and get me. <laughs> just if I shut the door, <laughs> Oh, God. I, feel, I actually feel sick. Stop it, stop it. <laughs> Take the lid off the spider catcher and then... Well, at least we'll have something to chuck over it if it does move. Right, I'm putting this camera down because otherwise I won't have my faculties about me. Hang on. I didn't even notice this pot's big in the <laughs> Ready? 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 Where's Dad? Can you call him? Dad? Tell him there's an emergency. Daddy, we need you. We need you. Well, you need to hurry up. It's an emergency. <laughs> Look, two of your daughters are in need. <laughs> I don't even want to stand on the floor because I'm scared it will come and like, climb up my legs or something. Doesn't look dead. Why? What are you... It's not even moving. Yeah, but I don't think it's dead. No, because in a minute it's literally, it will jump. So I just have Harry Potter in my head. <laughs> That's not even funny. <laughs> oh, stop it. <laughs> Rebecca! If that's broken. I'm sure it's fine. Can, Can you get that over it? Look, look, look. It's going to climb up the wall, it's going to climb up the wall, please. It? There! It's, in, it's still in the corner. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> Holy crap, it's Oh my life. lord! Give me the camera. No, you put that over it. No, Dad's coming. Dad can do that bit. Oh, I feel sick. How did they that? How do they get that big? The scary thing is I'm still more worried about that bloody spider than I am about my light that you've just knocked over. <laughs> Daddy's coming. Oh. You're gonna need that. Please, can you just catch it? It's big, look at it. It's an actual beast. Please catch it, please. Oh, look at the size of him, he's been eating a few children. <sighs> oh, it's hardly uh, active, is it? <gasps> Where's the top? Where's the top? Oh. Beautiful. Oh. Beautiful. Do you know, it is actually your fault that I'm scared of spiders because you scared me as a child. <laughs> no, get it away, get it away! Oh. Like I don't care. <laughs> please make it go away. <laughs> Can we go, please? Yes, please. No, no I'll, I'll go when you've got rid of that thing. Should we see if it works? I'm going to take the <laughs> blooming light. Can you just turn it on at the back and make sure it still works? Please when we find a family. Oh jeez, don't say that. Yes, it's still working. Okay. I was so scared you just smashed that. You were really not helpful, just hitting the light. Well, with... you were just sat there like a blooming... <laughs> we couldn't move. Really? Okay, we're safe. Come on, Is anyone else really bad with spiders? Because I'm fine when they're like smaller, but that one was just... Like it, it actually probably, I think it had like a whole like house on its back. It was that big. Oh god, my mouth's gone dry and everything. I honestly, I, I think I do have a proper spider phobia because. <laughs> oh, that was really not funny. She just comes in with the empty spider pot and tries to scare me by thinking that's what Dad used to do to me when I was younger. He'd chuck the spider out, then he'd bring the spider pot back. And pretend it was still in there and like pretend to chuck it at me. This is why I'm terrified of spiders. 
Right, okay, I'm gonna get back to my editing now. Oh, my heart is going. <laughs> He's going round in circles. Did Auntie Becky make that song up? No. no. <laughs> he's so excited he's going round in circles. Whee! Ho, 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 ho. Ho, 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 ho. Look at you, you're so grown up. He's grown. No. 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 You have, you've grown. Have you got big nuts? Uh, don't sit in the water bowl. Take him for a walk. <laughs> Don't sit in the water bowl. You take Freddie for a walk. Go on then. Go on then. Go for a walk. Go that way. Where are you going to take him? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, is that cold? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's raining, isn't it? We were going to play in the garden. You wanted to go on. Right, didn't you? We can't play in the garden. <laughs> oh, bless him. Noah, what did you buy when you went shopping? Did you buy nappies? Can you say nappies? Nappies for Noah? Did you buy nappies for Noah? Nappies? Oh. Oh, really? <laughs> Without thinking twice And I knew it would catch up And that we would be the ones Left behind The stories I've been told They never seem to lead my mind Ooh, On this road that I am on I gotta stay here for some Somehow made it through without losing sight mm -hmm. And I still wonder where you are And if you found a way out from the dark mm -hmm. The stories I've been told They never seem to leave my mind mm -hmm. And this road that I am on Gotta stay here for some time
Nanny, Nanny through the window. Nanny, back your <laughs> oh, it's Nanny through the window. Quick, get the spoon. Say hi, Nanny. actually spoken to you properly today um but yeah we've got Noah back again he didn't sleep that well this morning um so Rebecca had well he got up because he'd done a nappy um and she took him to Lidl to buy some nappies um and then when we got back he played with his little kitchen and everything for a while which he seemed to really enjoy um he hasn't seen that at ours I think he's got a similar one at his but that's the first time he's played with it here um and he was like cooking he was like stirring like stuff in the pots and then he'd like give you the spatula to like try it it was really cute um we've just given him his lunch and he's gone down for another nap because he hadn't slept very well this morning although he still seems a bit unsettled so i'm not sure how much sleep he's gonna get um i've had my lunch and i'm gonna go swimming now because <laughs> it's been a while since i went and i really need to get back on with it um so yeah, I think I might just go now and hope, I don't know, I looked at the timetable and it says supervised swim um, until three and I don't really know what that means. So I'm hoping that if I go now, I'll be able to still use the pool because I just kind of want to get it done and get home again. Um, I really need to write a blog post, but I just don't know when I'm going to have the time today and tomorrow's really busy as well. So yeah. We'll see, but I'm gonna head to, head to swimming now and hopefully they let me in. Right, turns out I'm not going swimming. Um, I've just driven over here. Thankfully it's not too far from my house, but um, when I got there, there was a note on the um, counter that said that on Wednesday, the 24th of April, which I think is today, um, <laughs> that they were closing at half past two um, because of staffing issues or something. And yeah, it's just after half past two, so there we go. But I couldn't really come any earlier. Well, I could have come right early this morning, I suppose, but I didn't. <laughs> um, and I couldn't come any earlier than this because they had uh, classes and stuff. So, yeah, I'm not going swimming. Um, which is a bit of a shame. I'd like to psych myself up for it, and I was quite looking forward to it, but never mind. I will head home and... Um, either play with Noah or get on with some work. I'd met a little black cat when I was going in and um, it kind of came over to me and like I was like stroking it and then it like got on its back and I was like tickling its tummy and it looked like exactly like Jaffa and it made me really sad because I miss him. Um, but yeah, it was really cute anyway. I'm gonna start crying if I carry on talking about Jaffa. Um, but anyway, I'm gonna head home because there's not much point in sitting around here. Yeah. It's not working. You've broken it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Have you broken it? Yeah. Yeah. If you throw the phone on the floor. You've only got hiccups. That might fix it. No, what sound does a sheep make? Can you do it? Bah. Bah. Or what sound does a cow make? Moo. Moo. What sound does a dog make? <coughs> what sound does a worm make? What sound does Noah make? Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's the Noah sound. That's Noah's sound. That's what Noah's say. Hello, Siri. I don't have an answer for that. <laughs> it's his favourite game, isn't it? Siri. Alright, let's go downstairs. Oh, yeah. bye. Can you wave bye-bye? Say bye-bye. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, can you take... <gasps> what is Noah doing? 
<laughs> we need to take you to the trampoline park, don't we? We're going to gravity force. Woo! Ready? Up. Woo! <laughs> Woo! <laughs> you won't even stand up properly. Stand up. Up. <laughs> up. 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 Just kick my back around the face. Becca? Becca? <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Oh. Hello. Ready. <laughs> Ready. Whee! Oh, it's not very slippery, so. <laughs> it's so good. Do you want to go? Not again. We're going on this one. <laughs> Can you a jockey? Yeah. Can you a jockey? Say wee! Wee! Cheese! Wee! Cheese! Wee! Cheese! Wee! Cheese! Wee! Cheese! Cheese! Noah? Oh, oh. Oh. It's so good! Oh, no! Oh, Freddy likes that ball. No wonder it's gone flat. Uh oh. Can you throw the ball? Walk mine the steps. Yay! Go and get it! Good boy. Yay! <gasps> yeah, go on then. I haven't got quite got kicking yet, have we? Go on then, give it a throw. Yay! <laughs> yeah, well done. I've just come out of my group. Um, it's always a bit weird when you haven't been for a week and then going back because you feel like you're like catching up with what everyone's been up to and stuff. Um, but yeah, apart from that, it was a really good group. Um, got quite a busy day today, so I need to get home fairly quickly, have some lunch, and then I'm going out with my mum because she's having her nails done and I'm then having a facial. So I'll take my laptop and try and get on top of some of my emails because it's getting a little bit overwhelming. Um, but yes, sun's out now, it was raining earlier, it's a bit windy so I feel a bit windswept but yeah, I don't think, well it's April isn't it, you don't know what, <laughs> the weather doesn't know what it's doing in April but yeah, I need to head home so that I can say a quick hello to Noah, have some lunch and then head back out again. Bend. You bend down and get the ball. Get it. Or do you need help? <laughs> you do not need help. You can get it. He knows the sign for help, doesn't he? Hello. He says, come on, get on with it, woman. I got it. Say, say please. He spat on me. Noah, say please. Don't poke her eyes out. <laughs> eyes? Eyes. Eyes. Ears. Where's your nose? Nose. Where's your nose? Where's your nose? Where's your nose? Where's your eyes? Where are my eyes? Eye. That's ears. That's ears. Where's your eyes? Thank you. It's Becca's eyes. Eye. Ah. Ears. Ears. Nose. Nose. Mouth. Nose. Nose, 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 nose. <laughs> 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 He's just messing about. 
News, 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 news. Bill, that's it. Bite, bite her finger off. <laughs> <laughs> eh, he says, yeah. Heads, shoulders, knees and toes. Nose. Knees and toes. Heads, shoulders, shoulders knees and toes. Knees and toes. And eyes. <laughs> no, Freddie. Mouth and nose, heads, <coughs> shoulders, knees, and toes. Oh, uh oh, Freddie took the ball. <laughs> Freddie took the ball. <laughs> oh, what have you found? <laughs> Could you give that to Jenny, please? Ta? Could you give that to Jenny? Oh, he wants to put it. He's going to put it in the. Oh no, he's getting the chocolate milk. Chocolate milk. He's managed to find a chocolate milk and a chocolate rabbit. How does he manage that? Oh, no, no, he wants the proper milk. Noah, <coughs> can you give the nanny to Jenny? Ta? Ta? Or give it to nanny? Oh, you can put it there. No, oh, she can't put it there. Put it in the fridge. You put the bunny in the fridge. He said put the bunnies at home, don't Milk. Oh, oh, he's found two now. <laughs> oh, two bunnies. Where do they go then? Can you all give them to Grumpy? Look what Noah's managed to find. Oh, what did you find those? <laughs> <laughs> in Mummy's shopping bag. Nan nanny's. Why were they in Mummy's shopping bag? Nanny's shopping bag. Put them in the fridge then. Where do they go? Says, no, the these are my chocolate rabbits. You want the rest in? Go in the bin. That's it, oh, put them back in there. Oh, oh. Yeah, right. they'll be broken right. now. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, they need to break to eat them anyway, don't we? Ball. Ball. Yeah. He's been playing with Freddie and Althea the garden. Yeah. He's been for a walk in the woods. Yeah, went for a walk in the woods, didn't he? With Alfie. Yeah, no, he didn't, he didn't get there, did you? Wood. We just took Alfie. Woods. Woods. Oh! Oh, Alfie. Uh, Freddie's got it. How did you get the ball? What are you cooking? Well, we've got um, some chicken and chips in the microwave. Interesting. What have you got in your pan? What? What's in there? Noah, what are you cooking? <laughs> it's an ice cream. Freddie, Freddie, let him get the he's ball. Boiling, he's boiling an ice cream. Great. Good boy. Can you throw the ball for Freddie? Daddy? You going to throw the ball? Daddy? Freddie, what? Yay! Please. Well done. Oh, it's it's What's in your saucepan? <laughs> Oh, an ice cream. Yeah. That's interesting. Oh, the ice cream. We're cooking some ice cream. Oh, nice. A little basket. To and, put in. and some crab. Sorry. A little basket. Uh -huh. And a burger. Yeah. We're boiling in some ice cream and we're cooking some crab and some shrimp. Oh, yum. Oh, lettuce. Oh. Does that taste nice? Is it good? Wash the carrot. Oh, nice. Oh. Yeah? Are you doing the washing up? Oh. Ow. Oh. Ow. <laughs> Silly boy. <laughs> boom, boom. Oh. Got to turn it on. That's it. <sighs> Can you beep the horn? Say beep, beep. Ow. Oh. Ow. Oh. 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 Press that. Go beep. Hey! And that one? What's that? <gasps> oh! Have <laughs> 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 you got Jenny's stick? <laughs> Say stick! Uh oh! Yes, I'm afraid so, Stick. <gasps> it's bigger than you. Try that branch. It looks stronger. You can do it. Yeah. 
sorry I've been a bit absent from vlogging today um, and also please excuse the fact that I look ridiculously shiny and <laughs> my hair looks really greasy. Um, I So this afternoon after lunch um, I went to my friend Katie's, my mum had her nails done while I did some emails and then I had a facial and she does like a scalp massage and stuff so yeah I look a bit shiny um, but it was really nice and I nearly fell asleep at the end. Um, but yeah, it's just been a bit of a manic day because I had my group this morning, got back and saw Noah for a little bit and did his lunch, um, but didn't really have any time to kind of play with him or anything. And then we went straight off to my friend Katie's and by the time we got back, it was like half four-ish. So um, I think we played with Noah for a little bit. I think Richard came to get him just after five. Um, so yeah, we kind of... He was all right to start with, and then he, he, I don't know, he was a bit fragile. I think his teeth were, like, upsetting him. Um, and he was just a bit sort of, like, I don't know, lots of different things kept making him cry, and he just wasn't very happy, so I didn't really want to have a camera in his face when he wasn't particularly happy. Um, so he just needed lots of cuddles, bless him. But, um, yeah, since then, I've just been kind of chilling out on the sofa a bit, um, doing a little bit of planning because I need to film some videos tomorrow and I haven't quite decided what I'm going to do yet and I'm still I'm still thinking. I've got lots of ideas kind of going through my head and I'm just trying, trying to decide what the best one would be to do. Sorry, I've got a really itchy nose. Um, See, so yeah, I've done that and then just had the telly on and been getting through some emails and things like that. So, yeah, it's been sort of a fairly busy but quiet day. I don't know if that makes any sense, but, yeah... Um, don't have any plans tomorrow which is actually quite nice because I don't know it just seems to have been really manic recently um and I think my body is struggling to cope with it a bit I've still got um this campylobacter infection um they retest my GP retested and it's come back showing that it hasn't gone and it's been there for months now like I mean they tested well, it was well over a month ago now, and that it was obviously there then, but I've been getting symptoms since probably like the beginning of this year, if not, if not longer. Um, no idea where it's come from and why my, well, I say that I've got no idea why my body isn't getting rid of it. <laughs> I just, I've not got a very good immune system, so I'm guessing that's why. Um, but my GP has got to contact microbiology again to ask what to do with me because like with campylobacter basically if you catch it really early um I don't know if I've got a red mark on my face I don't think it's just where I've been like I don't know if I got a rash um anyway yeah with campylobacter if you catch it really early then um antibiotics can work and can kind of get rid of it but obviously I've had it for months so it's kind of become this chronic infection and my GP just isn't really sure what to do because it's not massively normal to have it for that long <laughs> which is just typical of me um so yeah she needs to speak to microbiology and see what they advise but I just hope they come up with something soon because I just feel crap like really washed out I'm getting like awful stomach pain um feeling very very sick and just i'm exhausted i need to get my iron levels checked again because i've been off my iron supplements for quite a while and i'm wondering if the, like my iron levels are too low again as well but i need to sort out this other thing first but yeah just a little bit stressful but yeah anyway so tomorrow i've got nothing on and I'm looking forward to it. I'm going to, yeah, like I said, I'm going to try and film some videos, uh, finish writing a blog post, but just want to kind of take it easy and chill, not like having to rush things and, you know, just pottering around and doing things in my own time. Um, but yeah, just going to pop the TV back on now and have a quiet evening. Good afternoon. I have had a very, very quiet morning, um, slept until quite late and have just been kind of pottering around. Um, getting dressed, putting makeup on, the dog's barking at someone outside, um, yeah, and just getting myself sorted. I am now going to try and film, well I want to film two videos, I might 
see if I get one done before lunch and then one after lunch, we'll see. Um, but yeah, I just want to kind of get a little bit of pre-filming done so that I've got a few videos ready to go up. Um, but apart from that, I haven't really got any plans today. I want to finish writing a blog post. Um, possibly going to play on the Nintendo Switch with Rebecca now that it's all set up. But yeah, nothing nothing major planned because tomorrow I've got stuff on and Sunday we've got stuff on as well. So today is just a quiet day, getting bits and bobs done. Um, and that's about it. I'm wearing my new top from Oasis, which I quite like. Um, it's a little bit low, like if I'm, I have to be careful that I don't like lean forward too much because otherwise I just expose myself to everybody. But um, yeah, no, I really like it. They did it in a dress as well, but I went for the top and I think I'm quite happy that I went for the top. Um, and yeah, it's just kind of, it's like warm enough to wear it, but it's not hot, hot. So yeah, it's kind of perfect. But anyway, I need to turn my computer off because it makes too much noise when I'm filming and then get on with this filming. Right, so I've managed to film two videos this morning. I've actually, for the second video, it's actually going to be a three-part series. So I think I'm going to get some lunch and then I might try and film the other two parts just so that I've got that all done. Um, because it's for it's going to be for EDS Awareness Month, so I would quite like to have all three of them filmed. And also I'm in my zebra top, so... Um, I think it's quite apt for filming those videos. So yeah, I'd quite like to get the other two done um, while I've got everything set up. Um, but I need some lunch now because it's getting late and I'm getting hungry. <laughs> videos today which is kind of well, a bit of a record for me I think um but I've done so I've done one like normal video and then I've done my three like part of EDS one um so that should be those should be coming out in May hopefully for EDS awareness month um but yeah I'm quite happy with what I've done I'm just I'm just exhausted I really need to finish writing a blog post because I've still got that and a weekly vlog to edit um but it is what time is it like quarter to five and I'm tired <laughs> so I don't really know what to do um but I'm gonna pack up anyway first and then see see how I feel um I'm going out tomorrow morning but I have got tomorrow afternoon free so I might still be able to get some stuff done then um but yeah we'll see I'll see how I get on so it's actually been quite a productive day today um I've got my videos filmed I managed to finish my blog post in the end so that's gone up um I am absolutely shattered um but I'm quite happy with what I've got done I've just been watching one of my favorite programs which is Gogglebox I'm kind of halfway through it um and just it just makes me laugh I love it so much um it's a bit of a like roller coaster of emotions um it started off with them watching um what does it start off with? Oh, oh no, they were watching Line of Duty and um, it was obviously quite like fast paced and then one of the guys got his throat slit and that was all like pretty gruesome and then the next minute they're watching Antiques Roadshow and this woman has brought like a stife bear on and is being told that it's worth like £15,000 um, <clears> and now it's just gone to the break again and it was what they were watching um the movie the shallows i think it's called um it's with this like weird old shark that tries to kill this woman um it looks quite unrealistic but um i just love hearing all the commentary on it it just makes me chuckle um but yeah i'm going to get into my pajamas now take my makeup off and go and make a cup of tea um, and watch a bit of YouTube, I think.
health group that I run um, a couple of people have dropped out which is a shame but can't help people not being well um, but hopefully the rest will turn up um, so yeah quite looking forward to it I haven't done pottery painting for quite a while and uh, yeah I will show you what we get up to at the pottery painting this morning there was only four of us in the end um but yeah it was really nice it's quite like therapeutic and if you're feeling anxious or anything it really like takes all your concentration certainly with what i was doing i was doing quite a i don't know i think i showed you it was like a vase with like a detailed like flower thing on it um and yeah it definitely like took my concentration and kept me like focused and we had a little ch like good chat between us um and we got some like hot chocolate with marshmallows and yeah it was just really nice i love doing like arts and crafts and stuff like that and i don't really get a huge amount of time to do them so it was really nice to just have a morning of like being fairly quiet and chilled and just painting and doing something creative um so yeah, I'm really looking forward to seeing like what mine will look like. Um, I think they'll be ready to collect within, um, you know, from next week. So it takes like seven days to do. Um, so yeah, I'm quite excited to get mine back. Um, 
But so yeah, I felt a bit funny on the way home. Um, I picked up a panini in Starbucks and brought it home with me. Um, and I think my blood sugar was getting a bit low because I felt, I just felt, yeah, not brilliant. Um, and then when I got back, Lisa was here. Um, she'd come to pick up Noah because we'd had him this morning. Um, so yeah, I got to chat to her for a bit and play with Noah for a little bit, have a bit of lunch. And now I am just getting on, sorry about the door slamming, I think my dad's going out. Um, yeah, so now I'm back, I'm just getting on with doing a bit of editing of a weekly vlog. Um, phone's going mad, door's are going mad, I don't know what's going on. Um, but yeah, I've been having issues with my computer. I just, storage is a problem, it's always a problem. I don't know how, I'd love to know how other people that do YouTube work their storage because I'm constantly like struggling to fit like to store all the stuff on my computer um like I keep all my all my videos um on like a backup drive um and but all like my Final Cut Pro and stuff goes on to my main computer and just keeps getting to the point where it's full and you can't do anything until you've moved stuff around so yeah like if you're a youtuber or a blogger let me know how you store your stuff because just it drives me mad it really does like i've got this i don't know if you can see it there um which is a lacy backup thing um and that's three terabytes um and there's a, there's a fair amount of space on that so that's where all my videos go and my blog photos go on that um but it's actually the like pro the final cut pro, like program and it's backups and stuff that just seem to completely fill my mac up um so yeah do let me know what you guys do because i'm just pulling my hair out of it and i do ask my dad but he's He's difficult to pin down, let's just put it that way. Um, but anyway, we seem to be doing all right. With, with, I'm getting some stuff imported, which is the main thing. So I'm going to see what how much I can get done. Ideally, I want to get this weekly vlog edited and up today, which I feel like is maybe a little bit um, optimistic. But we're going to give it a go, so wish me luck. Hello, happy Sunday. I'm not feeling particularly great today. Um, I woke up with the intention of going to church and just kind of decided not to. Um, just feel very, very tired and keep feeling quite dizzy and headachy and just not top form, <laughs> unfortunately. Um, we're just about to head out though. Um, we're going to my aunt and uncle's in Ealing um, for like a little party for my grandma's birthday. So um, various other extended family members will be there and... The rest of my siblings will be there apart from David and Emma because they are on holiday. Um, so yeah, it should be quite nice. Um, I don't know how much I'm going to be able to film because obviously it's going to be extended family and other people and stuff like that. So may not get much footage, but um, I'm taking my camera to take lots of photos as well. Um, because I don't know, I always do at, like extended family events because I think it's quite nice to kind of capture it and have some photos to remember it especially for my grandma's birthday because it's because she's 93 and I just think it's you know, a special thing to sort of capture so yeah I will try and get a little bit of footage but if not I will probably talk to you again later Say night night to Mickey. 
think he might be hungry. I'm not waiting. Someone is hungry. Hello. <laughs> No. He says I am trying to eat, mummy. <laughs> He's like I put up with him because I know you bring me food. Oh, Dilly's being very vocal. Is it dinner time? Oh, hello! Oh, look at your hair! <laughs> look at your hair! You having a good munch? Oh, hello! <laughs> Are you beautiful? I think he wants a cuddle. He or she? He. He. He I just love the hair. I think it's kind of like Donald Trump hair. <laughs> it's kind of like Donald Trump. Oh, don't bite me. <laughs> don't bite me, please. Oh. You're very cuddly. Oh, hello. <laughs> Look at your blue eyes, they're so beautiful. Oh, they're so beautiful. Are you watching mummy? I think he's watching you, Ro. <laughs> oh, look, your friend's out as well. They're both watching. Look, Dilly's watching her as well. That's tomorrow's dinner. Breakfast, even. Um, <laughs> excuse me? It's alright, it doesn't matter. He won't go far if he comes out. Does he go far? Does he? Why is he not back? Come on, kisses. Kisses. Come over here. Kisses. Aww. Oh. That's just a bribe to give you a kiss. So, I didn't really film much at all at um, my aunt and uncle's house um it was just too much going on too many like different people um and yeah it was just just not really like suitable for filming um so yeah we kind of most like well spent a lot of time playing with noah and my cousin's little boy um who is nearly three i think um so we took them in the garden and they were playing with like the sand and uh, playing football and things like that. It was good fun and Noah seemed to really enjoy it. Um, so we did that and then we had lunch and did um, my grandma's birthday cake and um, I did try and film, I did film that actually on my phone so hopefully I've put that in. Um, and yeah, so we kind of did that and then by the time we'd like finished all that it was getting on for like four, half past four or something. Um, and we had to yeah come home um because the dogs needed to be let out and rosie needed to sort her horse out um so we went to see him on the way home which was quite nice because i haven't seen him for ages um and i'm not like I'm, I'm not like a horsey person necessarily like i've never been the kind of person that's wanted a pet horse or anything like that whereas rosie like from a very young age was into horses but I think I've got more confident around them since like Rosie's been into them just because I've been around them so much um I still they're still quite you know like they, they're big animals and um, I remember when I rode um Mickey which is Rosie's horse for the first time actually I think I've only been, I can't remember if I've been on him once or twice um but yeah I sat on him and 
I was just like, oh my gosh, this is slightly scary because they're really like he's really tall and um it was hard work like getting on him and yeah you can then I was like I don't know if I did, for some reason I didn't think that I would you know like feel him breathing and stuff which obviously you do um so yeah I'm definitely like I don't think I am the kind of person that would never get into horse riding but I do quite like going to see them and giving them a like cuddle and um he's got another horse next to him and then there's some other horses in the fields as well so it was quite nice to just go and see them and I, like, I love spending time with animals and like in the countryside type stuff so that was nice and then we came home and I've just like been having a quiet like rest of the day to be honest I haven't felt brilliant um I think I said I wasn't feeling brilliant this morning I kind of powered through um my grandma's party and then when we got in the car to come home I just I felt really ill um I was quite like I went quite pale and just felt very like um faint and dizzy and just not very well which isn't great when you've got a like longish car drive home um so yeah I've just been resting pretty much the rest of the day um and now I'm gonna get into my pajamas so I thought I would just come on and say goodbye because it's the end of the vlog um I hope you've enjoyed watching this week and yeah if you have and you want to see more please do give me a like and subscribe to my channel also leave me a comment um whether you want to comment on something that you've seen in the video or you've got suggestions or requests for videos for me to film in the future or anything else just let me know um and also don't forget to follow me on like Instagram and stuff. I'll put all my links in the description bar. And I will see you in another video very soon. Bye.